The Ken Burns effect is a very popular technique in filmmaking. It involves zooming into a still photo and panning across the image to add more visual interest. To create the effect, first add your photo to the timeline and left click on it to open the effect controls. You will need to choose the scale of your photo. Note here that still images often have a larger resolution than video timelines, so you may need to scale them down first. To create the effect, first make sure the playhead is at the start of your photo, and then zoom a reasonable distance into the photo. Then modify the horizontal and vertical position of where you want the effect to start. Next, set keyframes for both the position and scale options by clicking on the stopwatch icons next to them. Next, move the playhead to where you want the Ken Burns effect to finish, this is normally the end of the photo, and then adjust the position properties to pan across your image as desired. A keyframe will automatically be set, and you can now preview and play back your effect. If you wish to modify any keyframe, it's helpful to click the arrow controls in position and scale, as this will take your playhead exactly to the nearest keyframe in the corresponding direction and ensure that you're not setting extra keyframes by mistake.